Morning folks, uh, Monday motivation time for you, dedicated to the fantastic Sharon Long. Uh, I know you enjoy these, Sharon. Thank you so much for coming over and seeing me uh, last week all the way from Norfolk to hear me speak. Uh, quite humbling, made my week and reminded me why I, I do what I do. So thank you uh, for that. It's London Marathon week uh, for me, so uh, I've got a week left. Uh, well, just under a week now, uh, next Sunday. Uh, I'll be running 26.2 miles. Uh, as of this morning, I'm 13 stone 8. My goal was uh, to be 13 stone 7 for the marathon. Uh, I was 14 stone 4 about a fortnight ago. Uh, nothing special, no magic wand, no, always wonderful. Um, strategy, tactics is all I did. Uh, stay tuned. You Birmingham folks, weight loss talks have started, things are moving. Um, you want the good stuff, come and find the guys who are doing it, who make it work, who make it happen, and we will shoot show you the way. I want to talk about sacrifice uh, this morning. Oh god, here we go. You mean we can't eat the cake? Um, no. Um, well, actually, what I want to talk about is sacrifice. Now, I, uh, there are certain words that are used a lot in fitness and health and all these things that people are scared of, like sacrifice and discipline. I'm the most... I've lived... Hang on, how do I put this? You know, in my past, I smoked, I drank, I did some other stuff. I lived the life of fun, you know, going out all the time, partying, that stuff. There's nothing wrong with that. But, um, and, you know, watching like, loads of telly and all that sort of stuff, which is fine. Um, uh, people, t what's happening is from a marketing standpoint, to make you understand the messages, is that people are saying that you don't need to be disciplined or you don't need to sacrifice things in order to have long lasting weight loss. People are saying, well, you can just do this nine day cleanse or this 10 day cleanse or this 90 day cleanse or whatever, which is fine. I mean, if you're looking to get some weight off quick, I've done those things, there's nothing wrong with them. Um, but then it's sort of like, well, you don't really need to sacrifice a great deal in order to do that. I mean, I know people who've said to me, um, they can't afford to train or whatever, yet probably paying between sort of 60 and 100 quid a month for Sky. Now that's okay, that's that's the choice that they've got, but it's kind of like you put that into perspective, you think, well, hang on a minute, I mean, we're at this level where people will pay a lot of money for wine. I mean, there's some clients who spend uh, 200 to 300 quid a month on wine alone, um, and you could afford a good a good personal trainer like myself for that much money, and that could change your life. Now again, it's down to your priorities and what you choose to do, and you know, it's up to you what you choose to do, but when you make an excuse, you make a reason for not doing something just sit down and have a look at what you're actually doing in terms of time in terms of money and those things and just just ask whether it's worth it or not now i'm not you know i'm not one of these people that gives it the don't give up and you know make time it's because you can't do that life's not as simple as that you know when i lost weight i lived on my own it was very easy for me to do it. i had no kids um nothing like that and you know to, to, and, and no distractions as it were to, to do it so i'm not saying it's an easy process but i'm saying if you want to do it you've got to firstly look at you know what are you prepared to sacrifice and don't look at that as a bad thing just say, well, actually, what am I prepared to sacrifice in order to get me towards my goals? And that might be, you know, am I, you know, willing to? Uh, am I paying too much for Sky? I mean, I was paying fifty quid a month, and I don't watch telly uh, because I had all this. I had the, even the basic entertainment package, and I was like, well, I don't watch telly at all. Um, so, so it's looking at those leverage points. <coughs> excuse me, and just looking at. What things you can sacrifice? What time can you sacrifice? I mean, there's some great 10, 5, 10 minute workouts you can do. You don't need to be smashing yourself to pieces, running an hour here, two hours there, three hours there in order to achieve your goals. So it's important to remember this stuff, folks, and just remember that actually sacrifice is, is an important part of this process and you have to consider it um, when you're going through to get the long-term goals. I mean, you speak to anyone that works with us, there has been some sacrifice. That could have been time, that could have been financial, that could have been effort, that could have been anything. It's not about of hurting yourself it's just about putting in the effort required to get you to your goals and sacrifice is part of that you've got to understand that you know when you're running a business i mean i work with i train and support personal trainers on how to run good personal training businesses and it's amazing in our industry how people think it's not a business and you don't have to sacrifice things and things are going to be given to you on a plate and you can still go out partying at the weekend and expect to open up your shop on monday morning and have have everything there and you can get to that point with the right systems in place but at the start you've got to put the work in man you've got to grind you've got to graft, you've got to do the stuff um, to get you to this place where actually um, this place is, is amazing you know, weight loss and, and cracking the nut when you've been an overweight person like I was was amazing, but it does take sacrifice, but you've got to plan and look at, is this worth it am I willing to give up on certain things and if you're not, that's fine, but then don't make the excuses that you can't do X, Y, Z if you're paying £100 a month on Sky and you waste 
an hour a day chatting at the coffee machine or you waste two hours a night watching TV when you could be out exercising. That's your choice. But don't make the excuse. Just don't say you want to lose weight. You want to train if you're not then willing to sacrifice things that are going to help you get there. Uh, and that's just the, the, you know, the truth of it. You've got to look at what you need to sacrifice and what needs to be done in order to get you where you need to get. So yeah, London Marathon Week, I've had to make a lot of sacrifices for that. You don't have to run marathons. Uh, you just have to make sure that you've got the right systems in place that enable you um, to be successful and also you're looking at what you're prepared to sacrifice in order to get them. It doesn't have to be a lot but there may have to be some. So have a good week and I'll speak to you guys later. Cheers.